Rwanda has acquired a state-of-the-art catheterization laboratory. Among the services offered to heart patients using this technology include the treatment of heart conditions, correct the blood flow, repair holes in the heart, and locate blockages in the heart vessels. Previously, most of the people that needed this kind of treatment would travel to countries like Kenya, India, and parts of Europe. Some of the patients treated with heart disease by medical experts at King Faisal Hospital using this technology say that they found a positive response to their illness. I developed a heart attack condition. I thought no one would survive a stroke, but they operated me and I got out of coma and I got healed 100%. If it wasn't for this treatment, even with the little money I had, I would have died. I completely healed and I'm now feeling fine. They didn't operate me, they just inserted a device in me that helps my heart to properly function. I used to have extreme hypertension in 40 or 45, but now the problem has been solved. I feel as a young man. The Deputy Chief Executive Officer at King Faisal Hospital Kigali, Dr. Kalimba Edgar, says that the equipment was expensive but assured that it will serve every patient regardless of their financial status. This treatment has a price due to the fact that these machines are expensive to maintain them. The good thing is that the government took all this into account. Insurance companies are also helping us and it is treatment that we want to reach all the people. With the hand of the government and insurance companies, I think this will be possible. The Minister of Health, Dr. Ngamije Daniel, says that this program comes to combat non-communicable diseases as well as improving the services provided to the patients. As it is our responsibility, we want this health service to be available to everyone and at a good price. It will benefit everyone. Abroad, one has to pay 20 million Rwandan francs for an angioplasty procedure, but here in Rwanda, it is 4 million Rwandan francs. The management of King Faisal Hospital says that heart patients were receiving inadequate medical treatment due to lack of capacity. Many doctors are currently being trained on the use of this technology, which means that from the first month of next year, patients from neighboring countries will be receiving medical treatment in Rwanda. Innocent Mugabo, RTV News.